Um, nor do we have fun together. We may laugh or have fun, but it's probably not together, which seems to support the idea that we're not meant to be together. See, that's a, a big thing. When you don't have any more laughter or any more fun together, there is this stuff that creeps in that says, maybe we're not even supposed to be here. Because we, we, we don't laugh, we don't, we don't smile, we don't have fun. Maybe we made a mistake. Maybe she's not the right one. Maybe I should have never married him. I, I should have listened to my mama. Whatever. Uh, <laughs> so, now, here's the thing about the stranger stage. This is often where affairs begin. This is often where extramarital affairs sneak in. When you become strangers, your walls are down. What would you say about being strangers? Well, when you talk about affairs, too, maybe we're not in a place where we would ever allow ourselves to become physical with someone else, but you can have emotional affairs with someone. Yes. You can start, you can remain sexually faithful to your husband, right. but then be, become emotionally tied to someone else because they're listening to you, mm. and your wife is not. Or he's showing you attention and noticing your hair and your new jacket, and your husband didn't. Mm. So you begin to appreciate that and maybe walk past that man's cubicle at work because he does notice you when your husband doesn't anymore. Mm. Or you um, make sure when a group of you is going out for lunch to invite that woman who's nice to you at work too because you're in a group that's safe. But because you know she's going to dote on you because your wife is not. Is that real or what? Yeah. That's real stuff. Strangers. Strangers. Now, this also can be cured, but it's hard. You got something else? I do. One more thing. Say that. Um, the thing about strangers is 